Let us have some quiz. Question 1. The goalkeeper and defender blank doing well. A is doing well. B are doing well. C were doing well. And D am doing well. Now look at this. When two nouns refer to the same persons, both are treated as one subject. Here, the goalkeeper is the same person as the defender. Hence, both now are treated as one subject and takes a singular verb. Now, if one of the two nouns carries the definite article D or a determiner, then both refers to the same person. But a situation where both terms have their separate definite article or separate determiners, then they are treated as separate subjects. But here, both nouns refer to the same person and require a singular verb. A is, is a singular, A is plural, where is plural, am is singular, but only goes with I. So the correct option is option A, so that the sentence reads, the goalkeeper and defender is doing well. Number two, this man and that one blank a farmland. A, have a farmland. B, has a farmland. C, is having a farmland. D, has had a farmland. Look at this case. This man is one subject. That one is a separate subject. This case is different from the first one we treated in the sense that here both subjects have their separate determiners. Man has this and then one has that. Because they have their separate determiners, they are treated as separate word subject and they go with plural verb. Okay? Now, option A, have is plural. Option B, has is singular. Option C, is having is wrong because is is singular. Option D, has had is wrong because has is singular. So the correct option is option A. So that the sentence reads, this man and that one have a farmland. Number three, Paul and Silas blank the lecturer's question always. Now take note, the term always show that the action is a regular action. Here, Paul and Silas are two separate subjects since they don't carry any determiners themselves. Okay, so they take plural verb. Paul and Silas answering the lecturer's question always. B answers the lecturer's question always. C answer the lecturer's question always and d answered the lecturer's question always we need a verb one here a plural present tense verb answering is a present participle verb it needs an auxiliary and there is no auxiliary verb here so it is wrong answers is a sing is a singular verb it is wrong answer is a verb one plural present tense verb it is correct answered is a past tense verb it is wrong the term always shows that the action is a regular action and doesn't require past tense verb. So the correct option is C, so that the sentence reads, Paul and Silas answer the lecturer's question always. And finally, number four, the pastor and preacher blank a crusade tonight. A holds a crusade tonight. B hold a crusade tonight. C holding a crusade tonight. And D have a crusade tonight you answer this put your answer in the comment section thank you very much for watching